to it. Hi, this is Regina, Count Station Honey Farm. You know, the other day I showed you how to make the butter. Uh, and I had quite a few people wanting to know how to make their milk, buttermilk, cultured buttermilk. Okay, this is the milk that we got from the butter that I made. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take and add my buttermilk to it. Now this is buttermilk. I always keep this container and I just put it in. But what I do is I add this to this and um, that cultures it. So I take one cup of, the, of my other buttermilk, which is cultured. It's already got the culture in it. And I just add it to my regular milk that I got from making my butter. And what that's going to do, that's going to culture it because it's got an active live culture into it. Everything that you do, now you just put your lid on it. And of course, I'll put mine back into my buttermilk jar. But uh, just put your lid on it. Then you've got buttermilk to uh, have uh, to bake your things, other things in. Now, any time that you make butter again, if you want to take and make cultured buttermilk, you can use this buttermilk that you've made cultured and just keep it going. And you don't hardly ever have to buy buttermilk. Now, after a while, of course, your culture isn't going to be as, as active and you're going to have to buy buttermilk. But more than likely, for a couple times, you can use uh, the milk that you got from your cheese and you will not have to buy bu bu cultured buttermilk. So, this is Regina at Count Station Honey Farm, and thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you later.